I'm Peter Bodo, and this is Tennis.com's Quick Hits. Andy Roddick will not be playing the Olympic Games. Now, a lot of people are going to be upset about this. They feel that Andy should be there for reasons having to do with patriotism, for reasons having to do with his hardcore record. And it's really kind of surprising that he's not, given the fact that he has played Davis Cup so regularly for the U.S. The bottom line is Andy has looked at his list of priorities and he put the U.S. Open above the Olympic Games. And oddly enough, it's pretty much for the same reason as he would have played the Olympic Games. That is, he has, feels a kind of a patriotic affection for the U.S. Open, the way most athletes do for the Olympic Games. Let's face it, Andy Roddick has been close at the U.S. Open in the past couple of years. He has not been able to get quite over the hump. He knows that coming out of Beijing, a lot of the top players, Novak Djokovic, Rafael Nadal, Roger Federer, his main rivals, are really going to be pretty tired. He made a critical decision here that he's going to get a little help maybe from the Beijing Olympics to realize that final ambition. So all things considered, I think questioning his patriotism is a little bit crazy. That's it for Quick Hits. I'm Peter Bodo. For all things tennis, all the time, visit us online at tennis.com.